Philippians 3 1 21 guidance for everyone to take care of evil workers and only get the fruits of the Holy Spirit. It remains for you, my brethren, to rejoice in the Lord. I do not bother to write you the same things, and it is security for you. Beware of dogs, beware of evil workers, beware of circumcision. For we are the circumcision, who serve God in the Spirit, and rejoice in Jesus Christ, and have no confidence in the flesh. Yet I could also trust the flesh. If anyone else cares that he can trust in the flesh, I... Circumcised on the eighth day, of the stock of Israel, of the tribe of Benjamin, a Hebrew of the Hebrews. According to the law, I was a Pharisee. According to the zeal, persecutor of the church, according to the righteousness which is in the law, blameless. But what I earned was a loss for Christ. And verily, I also count all things for the loss of the knowledge of Christ Jesus my Lord. By which I have suffered the loss of all these things, and I count them as scum, so that I may gain Christ and let it be found in him, not having my righteousness which cometh from the law, but that which cometh by faith in Christ, even the righteousness which cometh of God by faith. To know him, and to the power of his resurrection, and to the communication of his afflictions, being made according to his death. To see if I can somehow get the resurrection from the dead. Not that I have already reached it, or that it is perfect. But I press on to achieve that for which I was also bound by Christ Jesus. Brethren, as for me, I do not think I have attained it. But one thing I do, and it is that, forgetting the things that remain behind, and advancing to those that are before me. I press toward the mark, for the prize of the sovereign calling of God in Christ Jesus. That is why all who are already perfect, let us feel this. And if you feel anything else, God will reveal it to you. But in what we have already come, let us walk according to the same rule, and feel the same. Be also my imitators, brethren, and be careful, according to the example which you have in us, by those who walk thus. For there are many of whom I have often told you, and now I also say, weeping, that you are enemies of the cross of Christ, whose end is perdition, whose God is the womb, and whose glory is to their confusion, who think only of earthly things. But our city is in heaven, from whence also we look for the Savior, the Lord Jesus Christ, who will turn our body down to be conformed to his glorious body, according to his effective power to subdue all things to himself. Philippians 3 1-21 Epistle of Paul to the Philippians, Chapter 3, Verse 1-21 Dear brothers, Paul is directing the brothers to have joy in the Lord, and Paul was saying that he did not mind writing the same things, because the gospel is always the same. And that by always speaking the same things, they would grow up safely in faith. In verse 2, he directs you to watch out for evil workers, and to also watch out for the doctrine of circumcision. For the doctrine of circumcision is the doctrine of the flesh. But we must serve God in spirit. And taking pride in the Lord Jesus, and trusting only in the glory of the Lord Jesus Christ, and not trusting in the works of the flesh. In verse 5 he reports that he was circumcised on the eighth day of his birth. And that, it belonged to the Jewish nation of the tribe of Benjamin, who was Hebrew, and who studied the law, and was part of the sect of the Pharisees. And because he was a Pharisee, he was a persecutor of the church, thinking that he was doing justice for the law. Judging that he was doing everything correctly. And Paul was proud to have this Pharisaic formation and to belong to the leading of the law of the Jews. But in verse 7 he declares, To me, which was gain I transformed it in loss by Christ. And in the truth I also have lost all things that I had previously, but now I trot all by the knowledge of Christ Jesus. My Lord and by Jesus Christ I suffer the loss of all these things, and today I consider them as garbage, that I might deserve the Christ, and that I might be justified in Christ. And leave my own righteousness, which was as by law, but that now, the justice I have, comes for the faith in Christ, to know the justice that comes from God, by the faith. And to know well Jesus Christ and the power that exists in his resurrection, and knowing the afflictions of Christ, that he was born to under death, growing in Jesus Christ. I want to arrive to my resurrection of the deadly, therefore I continued in the purpose of achieving in Christ my salvation and therefore, I were also bound by Christ Jesus. Not July that I have reached the resurrection, but one thing I have within me, forgotten all that past that has been back, but now I advance for the future things, that are before me. 
and continued by pursuing the target for the prize sovereign of the vocation of God, that is the salvation in Jesus Christ.